Jason. The family of late trooper David Kniff got a wonderful surprise this morning. His widow and two sons learned they're headed on a special trip to Florida. Dan Bazil was there for the presentation, and he joined us now with more. Dan. Kelly Trooper Kniff was killed on the thruway just about a year ago during a routine traffic stop. His wife says the holidays are bittersweet for the family, but this surprise will certainly bring some measure of comfort. The big announcement arrived at the Kniff family home in Duanesburg, complete with an escort from the Pine Grove Fire Department and the state police this morning. The reaction from the family was priceless when they learned that they're headed to different amusement parks in Florida, all expenses paid. It was all courtesy of the national charity Baking Memories for Kids in honor of Kniff's older son, Caleb. The seven-year-old is wheelchair-bound. He suffers from spinal muscular atrophy. The charity's founder says Caleb was chosen because he faced adversity his entire life and nothing compares to the loss of his father. It's definitely given us something to focus on, um, redirect the thoughts. It's not going to take away the sting, but every day hurts, you know, it's not just the 16th and 17th of December, so, um, but it definitely gives a bright spot. <laughs> You're running on adrenaline. When you announce this trip to these families that have nothing but pain and, and, and knowing that the end is not way down the road, and you get to tell them they're going to go on this trip, and you see the little children's faces light up. It's the best therapy anybody could ever get. Baking Memories for Kids operates only in November and December when volunteers bake thousands of containers of cookies and sell them nationwide. 100% of the money they raise go toward trips for kids like Caleb. Kelly? All right, thank you, Dan.